All right, what's up, everybody? This is Jose Trujillo, world's greatest living artist. And you guys are gonna be witnessing me doing a, 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 a pet painting here. I'm gonna do sort of like a figurative portrait type of painting. Uh, some of you, I'm using a little charcoal right here. Some, some of you have seen me paint and have heard me talk about intuitive painting and just the art, I guess, of just going for it, you know? Uh, if you are, if you, in any ch in any way, if you are redacting constantly your work, meaning you're trying to get it to look like something, it's probably not intuitive. Okay, it's probably not intuitive. And so, in intuitive means that that you are just flowing with it, just like I did right here. You're just flowing with it. Okay, that's all intuitive means. It doesn't mean that you go and you try to figure, figure, and uh, and you're trying to get it right and whatnot. That's not intuitive. Intuitive, intuitive is when you just flow with it, and regardless of what you get. And m many times we. Many times as artists, we don't... This is acrylic, by the way, for those of you who are wondering what it is. Uh, many times we don't... We, we can't really tap into our intuitive powers because we, are, we redact too much. There's a constant um, editing process that happens in painting, so you never really get to tap into your intuitive self. Which is a, it's a fucking uh, shame that we don't get to tap into that because because it is available to us. And uh, especially the more you paint, the more available it is to you and for you to tap into your intuitive powers. Intuitive also means that you are not going to fight the painting and you are going to be grateful for what is coming up, for what is showing up. And you're not even you're not even gonna be it's it's not even so much that you're grateful, like you sit there and you look at it, you you have this gratitude. No, it's it's that you accept whatever is coming into the space. It's a very liberating way of painting. It takes a lot of courage too. A lot of artists have a hard time with this because it does take a lot of courage to go into a painting and not know what you're going to get and uh, and almost having this feeling of am I doing the right thing or not and if you're having that feeling, you're already thinking about it, you know? So, in intuitive painting, you don't think about the painting. You don't think about the painting. The painting is not an object in which you think about. And then you can come back to it or you can leave it alone. It doesn't matter. But the, 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 the most important thing is that is to know that you have access. As an artist, you have access to that side of you, to that part of you. That more than likely you're probably you're probably avoiding. Because um, you're probably afraid of 
what people might think or if your work is not uh, best represented whatever whatever it is but there is that aspect of you in artwork and what I try to tell people is is tap into it use it abuse it um, you don't have to you know the more the less the less the less of you out there do it better for me probably I don't know uh, but then I can I can be like I'm the only one doing it I don't know <laughs> but, I, but I'm telling you it is available to you as an artist and very few people very few people actually tap into it because they again they're they're trying to make things right rather than doing things rather than getting things done they're trying to make things right and so they they, they cheat themselves out of something really cool which is intuitive painting in my opinion so but cheat yourself out of it it is available it is for you you can use it you can abuse it again I'm using some creams here to to go along with my Very, very simple stuff. But I, I, I think it's extremely, it's extremely effective. My name is Jose Trujillo. I hope you guys uh, enjoy this little segment. And uh, talk to you guys later, I guess. Uh, if you guys like what you see here, I have lots of works that I'm gonna be showing you. And uh, lots of them are also gonna be on my eBay shop. The link is in my profile. Take care, guys. Talk to you soon. Adios.